And there we have it. Origin are your champions for San Jose 2015 here at the Intel Extreme Masters. And you know what? At the end of the day, it's kind of what most people expected. Yeah. I mean, sure, some people thought maybe LGD Engineer would perform a little better. Mm -hmm. But that was also a chance. Seeing Origin on paper had the sturdiest lineup and the most recent strongest performances. I'd be happy if I was CLG, to be honest. I mean, yeah. they have the whole new roster. Yeah. Granted, they have a little bit more practice time than some of the other teams, but I think I'd be pretty happy with the results just making it to the finals. I saw some tweet online somewhere who somebody said, yeah, you know, every team here at IEM can be either happy, you know, because... I know who the, it is. Yeah, they have the, the potential, or they, their mistakes are easily identifiable, or they know what work is ahead of them, or like in the case of Origin, they just did really well, except LGD. LGD can just start crying. Yeah. <laughs> he can just continue to be sad here. Yeah, I mean, and then this has just kind of been a very fun tournament. As you're mentioning, every team has something to look forward to. TSM, hey, you know, on four days, pretty damn good. We're going to see them in January. I mean, basically, it was just like, it's it's... You know, sweeps everywhere, honestly. It's the cleanest tournament ever, right? Everything's swept up, nothing left on the ground. Just, uh, you know, North America got to win six games, so much better than Worlds. We got to semi finals. I'm going to, I mean, look. I mean, the, hey, I'm an American too. Like, I, yeah, I, no, hear no, I get you. you. But. Uh, I mean, I can make some excuses as well. I mean, you know, we didn't see Cloud9 or, you know, some of these like more put together North American teams <laughs> to, like, you know, really, really see if we can stand up to Origin. But no, I mean, Origin, I mean, truly an amazing team. Yeah. Truly yep. ridiculously good players and good shot calling. It, and they didn't miss a beat with Power People coming in. That yeah. was like the one small question. He's playing amazingly by himself, and the team is still gelling. Yeah, I mean, really credit where credit is due. And we do have a quick chance to speak with one of the winners on Origin with Sean on the stage. Thank you so much, Chobra. I am joined by Mithy and the team. First of all, round of applause. Now, Mithy, you just went ahead and, you know, won IEM San Jose 2015, booked yourself into Katowice. How do you feel? Um, I feel all right. <laughs> very good, sir. Very good. Now, you had a great performance at Worlds, and you absolutely dominated this weekend. What's next? What can people expect from you and the team in 2016? Mm, I mean, Spring Split is next, right? So. I think we're going to use that split to try and get a decent, uh, like decent points for the split and mostly figure, figure everything out in terms of how we work, what we should communicate, how we should communicate, and just in, like, expand on champion pools a bit more even. And I don't know, we will use spring split to prepare for summer split and then we're planning on getting the same or better showing at Worlds. That's my, that's my goal. Absolutely well spoken. Ladies and gentlemen, please, one more time, put your hands together for our champions, Origin! Congratulations, indeed, and everyone's still cheering. I mean, I, 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 like we said, we saw this coming, and they deserved it. And like he said, still, they're putting their head in the game. They do have a new player. They want to make sure that next year they don't just stop at the semifinals. They don't just say they're one of the best teams in Europe. They want to secure that, and I think we're seeing that hope, for sure. I just like that they have a long-term growth plan because it's really important that you plan out your entire season, mm -hmm. want to avoid burnout on some of these older veteran players, they know what it's all about, and then just, yeah, as, as Mithy said, okay, our key goals in Spring Split are this, this, and this. Once we nail that down, we can start expanding on that and really, really look to show up in summer. And I think that's a good approach to have because Origin right now, they have some leeway above yeah. other teams, so they can just use yeah. that to, you know, find you and improve themselves. While other European teams right now are still looking for their identity. True. And like you guys said, I mean, f of course we give our nod to CLG. And sure, that tweet, somewhat humorous, but I think it's true. With TSM, all right, well, we saw the individual skill, what everyone was excited about. That is there, so that's proven. And, and they got revenge over LGD, right? And like, they did. There, there were teams that were objectively pretty bad at this tournament, and they lost 0-2 in the first round. TSM showing, hey, look, actually decent. Oh, no, we lost to Origin, who got top four at Worlds. Oh, no, they, those games were like in some of the cases, as close to the CLG ones. Like, if they didn't start out 3-0 yeah. or 0-3 yeah. in the games themselves, like, that actually could have been a hell of a good series. Yep. And same with Jinner Green Wings. Uh, I mean, maybe not much has changed because they seem to already know that they were always missing that 1%, but just seeing how they pan out against others. This was their first time showing up at an international tournament and all that coming together for Origin to take that trophy home. So overall, I think, you know, it was a fun new look at a lot of these rosters coming in and what we can expect from them in 2016. What'd you think, Saint? Uh, I think everything pretty much went how I thought it would go, outside of CLG. They, they actually performed yeah. above my expectations. Granted, I think they had the easier part of the bracket, but Fair. I'm pretty surprised that they actually made it to the finals, and it's good for them, man. Yeah.
Impressive play from everyone for sure. For me, uh, I think CLG had better macro than I expected, mm -hmm. but I don't know, man. Hui and like, just like uh, yeah. Hui actually played as expected to me. Uh, <laughs> like that, that, like that's actually the player I remember from from casting NACS on Fusion. I was shocked when I heard he was on CLG. I mean, it, it like I don't want to like put a big damper on him, but like this. I mean, you got the CLG you, you team is about growth. Him. Yeah. And he's got a lot of growing to do if he wants to right. play on that level. And, and I he left that a lot of room for growth. Right. I mean, you know, and to be fair again for him to show sure you. You say the last thing you remember from him is there, but at the same time, that you also kept mentioning that was a while ago. Yeah. So we'll see how they grow. But again, Origin, congratulations. You take him that trophy. You secure that ticket to Katowice for the Intel Stream Masters World Champions. For all of you guys watching this weekend, all of you guys who showed up here in San Jose, thank you so much for making this a fun weekend for all of us League of Legends fans. And if you missed any of it, don't forget, you can go back, check all of it and play that TV plus more like the POV VODs. Also, over at ESL.gg slash Amazon IEM, those sales are still going. So if you want to grab yourself a couple presents or bring something home for Thanksgiving to your family, you can definitely check those out. For us, that's it for this weekend. We'll see you at the next Intel Stream Master Stop. Have a nice night.